Hello students, my name is Rohan Kadam and I'm here to discuss with you the grammar topic direct and indirect speech. Now students have told me that they have difficulty in this and that's the reason why this video I have made it. So here there are some examples and rules of direct and indirect speech. Let us see the rules of changing from direct to indirect speech. The first is simple present tense changes to simple past. The second rule is the simple past tense changes to past perfect tense. The third rule will changes to would in future tense everything else will remain same universal truths do not change so please remember these rules while changing from direct to indirect speech there are more rules from changing to direct to indirect speech I becomes he or she depending on the subject whether it is a masculine or feminine gender we changes to they when we change from direct to indirect and this changes to that so all these things along with the tenses should be in your mind when we are changing to the reported speech. In this slide we will see the rule how the simple present changes to simple past by an example. Sopi said to the policeman I need money to buy house. This is the direct speech. Now, let us change to the indirect speech. Sopi said to the policeman that he needed money to buy house. The sentence in the inverted comma has changed from simple present to simple past. I changes to he. And everything else remains the same. Sopi said to the policeman remains same. There is no change. Let us see another example where simple past changes to past perfect. The astrologer said to his wife, I did not stab anyone. Again, this is a direct speech. Let us change to indirect speech. The astrologer said to his wife that he had not stabbed anyone. This is a negative statement which is in the inverted commas and only that statement has been changed from simple past to past perfect. I has been changed to he, did has been changed to had, and rest of the things are same. Here we have an example for the third rule in the future tense where will becomes would. Shaz said to his friend, the whole India will be covered by forest. This is the direct speech. The indirect speech is, Shaz said to his friend that the whole India would be covered by forest. Only the will has changed. 
for the sentence which is there in the inverted commas. The last rule is about universal truths do not change. Wife said to the astrologer, Sun rises in the east. Now we all know Sun rises in the east and she has said it. So there will be no change. Let us see the indirect speech. The wife said to the astrologer that the sun rises in the east. No change. Only the inverted commas have been removed. So I hope all the rules are understood. Thank you so much for watching the video. If you have liked the video, please let us know. You can also write in comment box if any changes are required by which we can make the videos more better. I would also tell the students to subscribe the channel and hit the bell icon so that you get notification of all the future videos. So bye students.